Hello, Cosmos enthusiasts. Welcome to another fascinating episode of Astronomical Secrets. Today, we're diving into one of the most extraordinary and violent phenomena in the universe, neutron star mergers. Get ready for an electrifying journey to the edges of space-time, where we'll discover how these cataclysmic events become powerful sources of gravitational waves, revealing hidden secrets of the cosmos. In this episode, we'll unravel the mysteries behind these extreme phenomena and understand how they're revolutionizing our comprehension of the universe. Before we venture into the world of mergers, we need to understand what neutron stars are. Imagine a massive star, several times larger than our sun, reaching the end of its life. When its nuclear fuel is depleted, it explodes in a spectacular supernova. What's left is an incredibly dense core, compressed by gravity to the point where protons and electrons merge, forming neutrons. This remnant star, only about 12.4 miles in diameter, has a mass greater than our sun. To give you an idea, a teaspoon of this material would weigh billions of tons on Earth. Neutron stars are true prodigies of nature, spinning hundreds of times per second and generating magnetic fields trillions of times stronger than Earth's. To put this into context, imagine a common refrigerator mag. Now, multiply its strength by a trillion and concentrate it in a sphere the size of a city. That's the magnetic power of a neutron star. This colossal force has fascinating consequences, such as creating particle jets that extend for light years into space. Buisha. Now imagine not just one, but two of these incredibly dense stars orbiting each other. It's a cosmic ballet of unimaginable proportions. These binary neutron star systems are relatively rare in the universe but they are crucial to our understanding of extreme physics. As these stars orbit each other, they lose energy through the emission of gravitational waves. This process causes them to gradually approach each other, accelerating their orbital dance. It's a countdown to one of the most energetic events in the universe, the merger. To better understand, Let's make an analogy. Think of two ice skaters spinning around each other. As they spin, they gradually get closer due to friction with the ice. In the case of neutron stars, there's no physical friction, but the emission of gravitational waves has a similar effect, causing them to orbit ever closer. When two neutron stars finally meet, the result is catastrophic and majestic. In a matter of milliseconds, they collide at speeds close to that of light. The energy released at that instant is unimaginable, briefly outshining entire galaxies. Galaxies. During the merger, a significant fraction of the star's mass is converted into pure energy. Following Einstein's famous equation, E equals mc squared, this energy is released in various forms, light across the electromagnetic spectrum, from radio waves to high-energy gamma rays, and of course, gravitational waves. To give you an idea of the scale of this energy, Consider this, the energy released in a single neutron star merger is equivalent to all the energy the sun will emit in its entire 10 billion year life. It's as if, for a brief moment, all the power of the sun were concentrated in a single point in space. Gravitational waves, predicted by Einstein over a century ago, are ripples in the very fabric of space-time. Imagine the universe as a stretched sheet. Massive objects like stars and planets create depressions in this sheet. When extremely massive objects like neutron stars move rapidly or collide, they generate waves that propagate throughout the cosmic sheet. These gravitational waves travel through the universe at the speed of light, carrying precious information about the events that generated them. It's as if we could hear the universe, picking up the echoes of these cataclysmic events occurring billions of light years away. To better understand, think of a lake. When you throw a stone into the water, waves form and spread across the surface. Gravitational waves work similarly, but in three dimensions and through the very fabric of space-time. The difference is, that while waves in water are easily visible, gravitational waves are incredibly subtle, requiring extremely sensitive instruments to be detected. For decades, gravitational waves remained a theoretical prediction, impossible to detect due to their extremely subtle nature. But in 2015, LIGO, the Laser Interferometer Gravitational Wave Observatory, made history by detecting the first gravitational waves from the merger of two black holes. Two years later, in 2017, another historical milestone occurred, the detection of gravitational waves from a neutron star merger. This event, called GW170817, was not only heard by gravitational wave detectors, 
but was also observed by telescopes around the world, marking the birth of multi-messenger astronomy. LIGO is a marvel of modern engineering. Imagine an L-shaped tube with each arm measuring 2.5 miles in length. Inside these tubes, laser beams travel in an almost perfect vacuum, reflecting off mirrors at the ends. When a gravitational wave passes, it slightly stretches one arm and compresses the other, altering the interference pattern of the lasers. This change is so small that it's equivalent to detecting a variation smaller than the diameter of a proton. Before we continue, I'd like to make a special request. If you're enjoying this content and want more videos about the astronomical secrets of the universe, please follow our channel, like this video, and leave a comment. Your interaction helps us continue exploring these fascinating topics. Now, let's get back to our journey through the cosmos. Neutron star mergers are true cosmic laboratories. They allow us to study matter under extreme conditions, impossible to replicate on Earth. Through these collisions, we can test fundamental theories of physics, such as Einstein's general relativity in strong gravity regimes. Moreover, these mergers are crucial to our understanding of the origin of heavy elements in the universe. During the collision, conditions are perfect for the nucleosynthesis of elements beyond iron, such as gold, platinum, and radioactive elements. It's fascinating to think that the gold in our jewelry may have been forged in one of these cataclysmic cosmic events. To illustrate, imagine a cosmic factory where temperatures exceed those of the sun's interior and pressures are unimaginable. Under these extreme conditions, atomic nuclei collide and fuse, forming increasingly heavy elements. It's as if nature were performing alchemy on a cosmic scale, transforming lighter elements into gold and platinum in a matter of seconds. When two neutron stars merge, in addition to gravitational waves, they produce a phenomenon known as a kilonova. It's a light explosion a thousand times brighter than a common nova, hence the name kilonova. Kilonovae are rare and short-lived events but extremely informative. They provide us with clues about the composition of neutron stars and the physical processes that occur during the merger. The light emitted by a kilonova carries the signature of newly formed heavy elements, allowing astronomers to study the chemistry of these extreme events. Imagine observing a kilonova through a spectroscope. What we would see would be a series of bright lines, each corresponding to a specific chemical element. It's as if we were reading a cosmic barcode, revealing the exact composition of the materials ejected during the merger. This spectral signature allows us to identify elements such as gold, platinum, and even radioactive elements like uranium. What happens after the merger of two neutron stars? The outcome depends on the total mass of the system. If the combined mass is large enough, the final product will be a black hole. This newly formed black hole will have a mass less than the sum of the two original stars, as a significant part of the mass is converted into energy during the merger. In some cases, if the total mass is less than a certain limit, the result may be an even larger and more massive neutron star. These supermassive neutron stars are fascinating theoretical objects, potentially representing the maximum limit of what can exist before collapsing into a black hole. Think of this as a cosmic point of no return. There's a theoretical limit, known as the Tolman-Oppenheimer-Volkoff limit, that determines the maximum mass a neutron star can have before collapsing into a black hole. It's as if we were playing with the limits of nature itself, observing objects that are on the threshold between being an extremely dense neutron star and a black hole. So, neutron star mergers are not just cosmic spectacles, they are also powerful tools for cosmology. By precisely measuring the distance of these events through gravitational waves and comparing it with the observed redshift, scientists can refine our estimates of the universe's expansion rate, known as the Hubble constant. This application has profound implications for our understanding of the structure and evolution of the universe on a large scale. It may even help us unravel mysteries, such as the nature of dark energy, the mysterious force that is accelerating the expansion of the universe. Imagine we're trying to measure the speed of a moving car. If we know exactly how far away the car is and how long it takes to reach us, we can calculate its speed. Similarly, neutron star mergers provide us with a cosmic standard ruler. By knowing the intrinsic intensity of the emitted gravitational waves, and comparing it with what we detect on Earth, we can accurately determine the distance of these events. This 
combined with measurements of the redshift, how much the light from these events is stretched by the expansion of the universe, allows us to calculate the universe's expansion rate with unprecedented precision. As our gravitational wave detectors become more sensitive and our telescope network more robust, we expect to observe more neutron star mergers in the coming years. Each event will provide us with new data to refine our models and theories. Future projects, such as the Einstein Telescope in Europe and the Cosmic Explorer in the United States, promise to take gravitational wave detection to a new level. These instruments will be able to detect neutron star mergers throughout the observable universe universe, ushering in a new era in gravitational wave astronomy. The Einstein telescope, for example, will be built in a triangular configuration, with each arm measuring 6.2 miles, making it two and a half times larger than LIGO. It will be built hundreds of yards underground to minimize seismic noise. Imagine a detector so sensitive it can feel the vibrations of space-time caused by events that occurred billions of years ago, when the universe was much younger. Additionally, Astronomers are planning space missions dedicated to gravitational wave detection. LISA, or the Laser Interferometer Space Antenna, a collaboration between NASA and ESA, will consist of three spacecraft forming a giant equilateral triangle in space, with each side measuring 1.55 million miles. Operating in the vacuum of space, free from earthly disturbances, LISA will be able to detect gravitational waves of much lower frequencies, potentially revealing mergers of supermassive black holes at the center of galaxies. These new technologies will not only expand our ability to detect neutron star mergers, but will also allow us to observe a much wider range of gravitational phenomena. We may potentially detect gravitational waves from the Big Bang, providing an unprecedented view of the first moments of the universe. Neutron star mergers represent one of the most extreme and informative phenomena in the cosmos. They offer us a unique window into the most energetic processes in the universe, challenging our understanding of fundamental physics and enriching our view of cosmic evolution. As we continue to observe and study these extraordinary events, we are unraveling the deepest secrets of the universe, from the origin of heavy elements to the nature of space-time. Each detected merger is a testament to the violence and beauty of the cosmos, reminding us of how vast and mysterious the universe we inhabit is. These cosmic collisions show us that the universe is a place of constant change and evolution. Neutron stars, remnants of stars that lived and died long ago, continue their cosmic journey, eventually merging in spectacular events that shape the fabric of the universe itself. It's a powerful reminder that even in the apparent emptiness of space, dramatic and transformative processes are constantly occurring. Neutron star mergers also remind us of the fundamental interconnectedness of all things in the cosmos. The atoms in our bodies, the gold in our jewelry, and even the iron in our blood all have a cosmic history. Some of these elements may have been forged in neutron star mergers billions of years ago, traveling through the vast ocean of space and time before becoming part of us. We are, literally, children of the stars, connected to the most extreme events in the universe in ways we are only beginning to understand. Looking to the future, the field of gravitational wave astronomy promises to revolutionize our understanding of the cosmos. With each new detection, each new merger observed, we are expanding the boundaries of human knowledge. We are learning not just about distant objects in space, but about the very nature of reality, the fabric of space-time, the origin of elements, and the fundamental laws that govern our universe. And perhaps the most exciting aspect of all this is that we're just at the beginning. With new observatories and technologies on the horizon, the coming decades promise to be a golden age for astrophysics. Who knows what surprising discoveries await us? What new mysteries will be revealed? What paradigms will be challenged? Neutron star mergers, these cosmic beacons of gravitational waves, will continue to illuminate our path as we navigate the mysteries of the cosmos. They are a constant reminder of the wonder and mystery that surrounds us, an invitation to continue exploring, questioning, and seeking to understand our place in this vast and extraordinary universe. If you were as fascinated as we were by these cosmic wonders, 
Don't forget to follow the Astronomical Secrets channel for more incredible content about the universe. Like this video and leave a comment with your thoughts or questions. Your participation fuels our ongoing quest for cosmic knowledge. Remember, every time we look at the night sky, we're looking at a vast cosmic laboratory where events like neutron star mergers are constantly occurring, shaping the universe and teaching us more about our own existence. Each star, each galaxy, each gravitational wave detected is a piece of the great cosmic puzzle we're constantly trying to put together. So, the next time you look at the stars, think about the incredible stories they have to tell. Stories of cosmic birth, life, death, and rebirth. Think about the invisible waves of gravity that may be passing through you at this very moment, carrying messages of cataclysmic events that occurred billions of light years away. Until the next episode, where we'll continue to explore the astronomical secrets that make our universe so extraordinary. Keep your eyes on the stars, your ears tuned to gravitational waves, and your mind open to the wonders of the cosmos. The universe is waiting to be discovered, and together, we're just beginning our journey of cosmic exploration.